as broadcast meteorologists, it's our job to keep the public safe. And during severe weather, that's maybe uh, breaking into programming to talk about a tornado warning, to track a storm. But when it's quiet, especially, it's educating the public about climate change because that is a huge issue and it's a safety issue for all of us. So how did you do it? How did you start communicating that information? I brought it up with station management uh, after my time covering those storms and said, we should be doing more. And how about a weekly series? It was met with skepticism because they said, well, we usually we have to have something that can sustain itself for a while if it's a recurring series. Uh, an executive producer and I worked on a storyboard and we soon found it was overwhelming the amount of content that really could come from covering climate change. Um, at the end of the day, there were a lot of people that were appreciative of it, but it ended with a, essentially a death threat that I received and a series of harassing emails from the same individual. Uh, and even after police arrested him, it was something that left me and my family concerned and kind of worried and always looking behind our backs. And uh, after a year of going through extensive therapy, I just decided that this wasn't the move for us and we, we ultimately left. And I didn't leave because I was scared. I left because I wasn't able to do it more. <laughs> and I thought I could make a bigger difference if I left that situation, if they weren't going to allow me to, to, to communicate about it anymore. So I'd love to hear your thoughts because of what you've been through on effective climate communication and the best way to go about it in these different scenarios, whether you're a broadcast meteorologist or whether you're, um, you know, just a concerned citizen. Emily, you have to know your audience and you can't talk down to people. You can't sound like you are this expert authority figure, even though you are an expert in the subject matter, people don't like to listen to people that are talking down to them. And you need to find issues that are important to them. 